Hey guys, it's Amanda. I'm an American living in the UK, so I post about my life and experiences living here, as well as these weekly reactions requested by all of you. Now, months ago, I watched two Ronnie's Four Candles, so it's about time I watched another one you guys requested, which is Cross Lines. Remember to leave your recommendations in the comments or head over to Instagram and leave them there and say hello. Maybe even give me a follow. I need more friends. <laughs> also, let me know what your favorite Two Ronnie skit is. Hello. Hello, Simon. Hello, Gerald, yeah? Um, hello, Doris. Doris, it's me, Walter. <laughs> How are you, old man? Uh, all right, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Simon, I had to ring you up to find out how you got on with that fabulous new girl last night. Uh, not too bad. There were one or two things I couldn't quite get hold of. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes, I know the kind of girl, yes. Where did you take her? Somewhere exotic? Um, Sainsbury's. <laughs> uh, Bianca Jagger goes there, doesn't she? I think the best thing I can do, dear, if, is to go through the list with you. Yes, yes, that's a good idea. So what was she like? I mean, what sort of girl? A French bread. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bloomers too large. <laughs> Well, kept slipping down, you mean? <laughs> oh, well, if you will go ice skating, you will keep slipping down, won't you? Yeah. And rolls for 20p. She doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say her name was? Hovis. <laughs> I think I know her. Listen, isn't, isn't she pregnant at the moment, though? No, no, no current buns, dear. No, no, the, no, no they've run out. Um, a tin of something for the cat. This all sounds very fishy to me, old boy. <laughs> very fishy indeed. Did you say her parents were in oil? Yes, the pilchards. <laughs> well, she sounds a right little raver. I don't know how she had the energy. Uh, she said the milkman hadn't been round yet. <laughs> well, that would explain it, of course, yeah. What did you do? I had to get sterilised. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> to be on the safe side, I'll put them in the fridge when I get back. <laughs> well, rather you than me, old chap. <laughs> Now, uh, where was I? Um... So, she took you home and gave you a nightcap, did she? I yes, say. Uh -huh. yes, dear. What sort? What? Yes. That sounds a bit of a puffy drink, old chap. Well, it's all she had, fairy liquid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see, I see. She had the bit of lemon and you had something stronger. Yes, three tins of curry powder. <laughs> yes, just to keep you going, eh? <laughs> you lucky devil, I wish I'd been there. What sort of perfume was she wearing? Something, something really exotic. Uh, salt and vinegar <laughs> and smoky bacon. <laughs> Making a pig of herself, was she? Oh, sorry, that was a mistake, dear. She was what? Wearing a cross your heart bra? I thought it said Oxo. <laughs> <laughs> so you naturally took the opportunity of having a quick. Uh... Butchers, yes, dear, yes. <laughs> yes. Yes, I didn't forget the steaks. You saw her do what to the bra? Fill it. <laughs> Two portions of sirloin. <laughs> yes, I did make sure they were tender, dear, yes. So I see you had her sitting there, nicely on the boil. In what did you do? I went across the road for some apples. <laughs> That's all you need, isn't it? I mean, that is all you need. A dog leaping up into your lap. Yes, the crunchy sort. <laughs> With the yellow skin, you know. Uh, golden Retriever. Golden Delicious. <laughs> I bet he bites people, doesn't he? And Coxie's Pippins. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm sure. What a terrible thing to happen. So, so what exactly did you say? Uh, my three minutes is up. I'll have to go, dear. <laughs> That's about all you could say, I suppose. Yes, dear. <laughs> Listen, you haven't told me yet, Simon, what this girl does for a living. What? She what? She works at Sainsbury's. You forgot your champagne, Walter, darling. That's for us, dear, later. I say, Simon, is this girl about six foot tall, blonde, big blue eyes, and other things to match? 
Uh, oh dear, I'm going to be late. Um, I've got a fair bit to see to. <laughs> <laughs> I should forget it all, Simon. I'm sorry, old sport, you've been short-changed. <laughs> My little basket. <laughs> the timing. Honestly, at the beginning of the skit, I felt like I, well, I felt like I couldn't breathe. I was, it was hard for me to get a breath in. They are so funny. You just don't get that sort of humor anymore. It's not like obvious in your face, but it's so clever. Honestly, I really, really enjoyed that. I don't know how they keep it together for as long as they do. They are so talented. The delivery, I don't, I'm going to say it again, the timing. Outstanding. Please keep the recommendations coming and I'll keep watching. And as always, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, smash that like button if that's what you're into, and I'll see you in the next video.